excited. If you're just joining me, good morning, I'm Valerie Stepp. We're gonna be slicing and dicing and cooking and grilling, so I hope that you stay with me. I know that there's a little bit of a hold from our previous hour on 10 faves, so definitely use Express Automated Ordering, our mobile, our mobile app. But we're gonna jump right in to uh, one of my personal favorite items. I think we've had all of my favorite items. I keep saying that today. <laughs> I know, well, um, but it's I mean, been a lot of really cool stuff It's been a lot today. of really great stuff. This is the only airing of the plate handheld mandolin yes. uh, slicer dicer extraordinaire that comes with a precision peeler. So we actually um, have it on FlexPay today for less than $10. If you own this customer pick from plate, the handheld mandolin slicer, I would love for you to give us a call. 1-866-376-8255. John Florell is Hello. joining me this morning. We're going to get started. We're going to jump right in. You know, this is like in. your own little sous chef, okay? Oh, I like that. Every professional uh, chef out there in the world has a mandolin in their arsenal of kitchen tools somewhere. And with plate, now this is the, uh, I mean, talk about quality. Plate is all about quality. Mm -hmm. Now, I want you to notice, I don't have to worry about this blade because right now it's in the lock position. This is the storage position. The blade's all covered up. This blade is razor sharp, and that's why this machine works. But that's also why we give you the safety holder. And it has a little guide that you can use that keeps, look, keeps your fruits, vegetables, meat, and cheese right where it's supposed to be. So it's so simple. You put it in a bowl, around a bowl, on a bowl, across a bowl, or you can do it on a countertop or tabletop. Watch how simple. Anywhere, watch everywhere, how simple. all the time. Look, this little t there's a little tab right here. I'm going to slide that up. Every okay. time you slide that up, it adjusts the thickness of your slice all the way up to the storage. So I'm going to put this on the thickest slice and show you how easy it is. Start at the top, slide it to the table. You slide it back up, back down to the table. Every time you slide it back up and down across that blade, you get a perfect uniform slice for things like pan fries, home fries, raw fries. They'll all fry up evenly because they're sliced uniform and evenly. See, when food's cooked you know, or sliced with a knife, you get one thick slice, one thin slice. These are all the same, so they're all going to fry up at the same time. And that's the nice thing about a mandolin is you get those uniform slices. Now, when you get close to your fingers, uh, if you've ever slipped on one of those old four-sided tin can knuckle buster graters that everybody has, there's nothing to protect your fingers. Right. Now, with the safety holder and this guide, it takes it right down to the end so there's never any waste and you get perfect uniform slices. Look at this, it takes it right down to the end piece. Mm -hmm. Now, here's probably the hardest thing you'll ever have to slice in the kitchen because nobody ever seems to have a knife sharp enough nope. for a red ripe tomato. Yep. Well, with this machine, on, on the inside of this cup, I want you to notice, there's four stainless steel prongs. They hold the food, you hold the holder, and now, across the bowl, in a bowl, or you can slice right on the countertop or tabletop, you get perfect slices for your salads, for sandwiches. Here, I've got this big old giant oh, sub up you. here. Look at That's this. That's just for we me. Made Where's this yours? For, <laughs> this is like a, a two-foot-long sub here. But look at this. I mean, perfect uniform slices for your salads, for sandwiches, or for sauteing, you'll love it too. Now, if you like the slice, but you want it thinner, here's how okay. easy it is. Yep. All you do is adjust this little tab right here at the top. So, so I don't have with to change your, out yeah, any There's blades no or extra parts or pieces. This oh. is everything right here. So I'm gonna go to the thin slice, and I think you're gonna love this for things like bread and butter pickles, or for cucumbers, for you know sliced cucumbers for cucumber and onion salad. You'll nickel down carrots for canning. You'll slice beets for pickling. I mean, paper thin, perfect slices for salads, for sandwiches. Look at that. I mean, perfect. Any thinner than that? I want to look at that. Do you know I how mean, <laughs> long it would have taken me to right? try to cut those with a knife? It would have never happened. Every slice is exactly the same, so it's not like a knife where you get one no. thick, one thin. And you know where you're going to love that thin, thin slice, I think, is for onions. Because if you've ever sliced onions with a knife, uh, like most people have, you ever notice when you're slicing onions thin with a knife that the more you cry, the thicker the slices <laughs> always end up? Because you just want to get the job done. Yeah. Well, look at this. Before you even have time to cry, I've, I've look at that. A perfect sliced onion. Here, we'll put these out here oh, on the okay, top good. of that yeah, sandwich, keep too. My sub. I'm going like to keep this. building this uh -huh. sub up for you. But yeah. look at the slices. They're all the same. Saute for peppers awesome. and onions, steak and onion, liver and onion, for potatoes and onion, for thin sliced onions, for heroes and hamburgers. I mean, it saves you a ton of time. But yeah. here's what actually this machine was originally made to do over a hundred years ago in Germany. Okay. They were originally made as a cabbage board for shredding cabbage for sauerkraut. Oh. Now you're going to love this with iceberg lettuce on taco night. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can shred lettuce for tacos, you're cabbage for mind. coleslaw, hot slaw, pepper slaw, chow chow. I mean, it, it comes out more like shredded wheat. 
than shredded cabbage. I mean, look at that. That'll melt right into your mouth. But the nice thing about this mandolin is it's so versatile. Here, I'll put mm -hmm. this out here on the tray in the front. Look at this. I make a little vegetable tray here. I like it. Uh, you know, the best thing, like I said, is the versatility of this machine. Right here on the side, you'll notice there's a little tab that slides back and forth. Mm -hmm. And look, there's pictures, okay? And it does come with instructions. There's words for the ladies, pictures <laughs> for us men. So no, everybody can use this. But you can see how you get those teeth that pop up. Those are your Julienne teeth. So if mm -hmm. I wanted to Julienne, let's say I wanted to Julienne, well, a carrot or a zucchini, you can do that. Okay. But anything that grows in layers, like cabbage, onions, celery, see, now instead of coming out shredded for coleslaw, for long stringy coleslaw, now you can chop your cabbage oh, deli wow. style. So you, it's such a versatile tool, and you know where you're gonna love it is for onions. I mean, yeah. imagine, if that does that with a cabbage, imagine what you're gonna do with onions, and talk about saving time. You can use it with this little guide, Which and look at this, yeah. right-handed or left-handed, Look at this. If you're still shedding tears over over onions, look at that. It's done perfect each and every time. For tuna fish, for chicken salad, for homemade meatloaf, on taco night, for chili. I mean, I could keep going you on, could and go on. on. I'm getting and hungry. And, <laughs> and the thing is, I, I will say, John, I without a mandolin slicer, yes. I have been guilty that I have gone into the section in the grocery store right? and I have overpaid it for the yeah. overpriced already sliced, diced, chopped right. um, condiments. You know, yes. whether it's the tomatoes, yes. the onions, the slaw, it's everything, the, the carrots. Imagine in literally in seconds, you're able to get whatever style, whatever produce you wanna use. And I have to remind everybody too, cause I'm just looking at the screen. We have flex pay, but it's only today and today only. Oh, wow. Three flex pay. We've already taken $10 off for our fall price. So less than $10 gets it home. And John, I know you're over there I mean, slicing and dicing, but we have color options. Oh yeah. Let's quickly show, uh, you have a choice of color this morning. So maybe you want to pair it back with whatever your home decor is. We do have it in the black. We also have it in the red. We have it in the green and we have it in the white. I really like this white one, that's really nice. But one of the other things we haven't even mentioned is you're actually getting a precision peeler as well. That's right. in addition. Oh yeah, that comes this with is, it. Yeah, this is a set that you're getting this morning. So it's a two piece so set. I love it. That's the cool part about this. Yeah. With this peeler, too, now I'm not taking the time to peel my t potatoes. I'm, I'm going to make some shoestring yeah. french fries here. Okay. But if you want to take time and peel your potatoes, you can do that, too, um, with that peeler. So, but look at this. I, I mean, love it. talk about french fries, fries in minutes. I mean, in seconds, actually. Yeah. But not only, not only regular french fries, you can do things like, here, you want to make sweet potato yes, french fries? I do. You can make sweet potato french yes. fries. You want to make carrot sticks or zucchini spears for a vegetable tray? You can do that with the machine. I mean, look at this. You, there's, it does way more work than those expensive electric machines, but it's quick, safe, fast, and easy. Now, here's something else I love about this machine. It saves you a ton of time. How much time does it take to chop celery with a knife? Um, days. Right, for me, look. days, and I'm worried about my fingers. You and... can chop more <laughs> celery in 10 seconds with this machine than you could chop in 10 minutes with a knife. You can do the whole bunch all at one time like this instead of one stock at a time, mm -hmm. and look at this. I mean, mounds of chopped celery. Yep. Instead of dragging out a heavy food processor, which, you know, you end up with strings wrapped around the blades and all that other stuff. Yep. Now, and it, that's a pain to clean, The too. difference, too, here, I'm going to go to a, a larger French fry, okay? I'll show you. All you do is move this little tab here. Now you can make your big French fries, big carrot sticks. Instead of chopping celery, okay. if you run it through this way, right. you're gonna get larger chunks of celery. Okay. If you run it through this way, now you're using the length of the celery to make those celery spears for your oh. vegetable trays. Or if you're into stir fries or have a walk at home, hey, stir fries are quick and easy to cook. They're healthy, they're good for you. Now with this machine, they're quick and easy to cut That's too. That's something really interesting you said, healthy and good for you. Yep. Why are you not eating your produce? Why are you not adding all the good for you condiments? Right. Is it because you have to take out that food processor? Is it because you don't know which knife to use is it because you're just not handy with a knife in the kitchen in general or how much time it takes for you to get all of that work done you've watched john literally do <laughs> so much food he doesn't even have enough room on the tray plus he outfitted my sub over here right, right. so this honestly this is a must-have in the kitchen especially if you're someone that doesn't really like to spend a lot of time in the kitchen because it takes yeah. the prep work and the guests and that's out of the it. whole thing it does it really and now here's here's the difference too i like to show you the difference in the slices okay now this is your thick slice okay so you 
you can do things like, you know, for oh, for battered eggplant, okay, you dip those in the batter, you can deep fry them or however you like. Eggplant or put, put them in, yep, yeah. absolutely. Now, if you like it thinner than that, you move that little tab right here at the top, okay? You slide that forward, that brings that platform up, so now you're making a thinner slice, and if you like it thinner than that, okay, for like an eggplant rollotini, oh, then you slide it up one fancy. more notch, and look at this, and now you can do a super thin slice, I mean, paper wow. thin like this for eggplant rollotini. And in fact, here, we did this with cucumbers earlier. Oh Put some hummus goodness. and Look cucumber together. Stick a toothpick That's for a fancy. nice little hors d'oeuvre. How about thin sliced apples? If you have a, uh, a cupcake pan at home? Uh-huh. Spread them out in a they cupcake pan. They look like pan. little rosettes. Oh, yeah. I know, make apple rosettes. You can garnish it however Think you like. I how mean, expensive that would be if you went to yeah. the pastry section and now in your you grocery can do store that and you can do it at home. Because you have the precision tool. I mean, even for things as simple as this, as simple as making homemade potato chips, okay? Why buy potato chips in a plastic bag when you can make them in seconds yourself? You put these in cold water, mm -hmm. okay? They curl up like a regular potato chip and they get hard. Mm -hmm. All the starch soaks out. And then you can spread these out on a cookie sheet in your oven. Sprinkle some Parmesan cheese or barbecue salt over the top. You season them how you like, but everyone comes out perfect and baked is better than deep fried anyway. And it's I mean, portable. <laughs> this is portable. So maybe you're always the one that gets invited yes. to bring all the condiments to the party. You know, there's tailgating yep. coming up. We've got back to school parties. And um, you bring this with you and in the seconds you're, you're just slicing and dicing and chopping and julienning and doing everything that you want. What's great about it too is it's so versatile. I mean, yep. it fits, you can do this right on a counter top like I said or it fits over any size salad bowl oh, so if cool. you want to do maybe you want to slice up a bunch of radishes over the top of a salad all you do is put them in that little cup slide slide it back and forth there's no waste that's all that's left is that very last slice and that can go right into the salad but look at this every slice is exactly the same. So it's not like a knife where you get one thick, one thin. Oh, and by the way, I gotta show you this because we've done slicing, dicing, chopping, mincing, shredding, we've julienned, we've made coleslaw, Did french fries. <laughs> and, um, but look at this, it'll even take corn off the cob four or five rows at a time. Hey, I went to the Ohio State Fair a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. I saw a corn stripper at the State Fair. What kind That's, of stripper? Uh, it's called a corn stripper. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll tell <laughs> listen, you throw it a couple of bucks, you know, no, it was like $29.95 for a for corn stripper, that. okay? That's all it does is take corn off the cob. Here's a machine that makes french fries, chops onions, it does cabbage coleslaw, and it'll take corn off the cob four there's, or five rows at a time. Whether it's blanched corn, let me do that again in case no you missed waste. it. I know. Whether it's blanched, cooked, or raw, wow. for creaming or steaming, for boiled or buttered corn, for mm. relishes, for corn chowder, it's, you know, instead of using a knife to take corn off the cob where the kernels fly all over your kitchen on that you know it gets in your hair your eyebrows everywhere else now look at that you can freeze corn in the summertime and have it all winter at summer prices. I love it. And uh, <laughs> I know we keep talking about our favorite things about this, the fact that it's yeah. portable, the fact that <laughs> right? it gives you every time. But there's no blades for you to change out. I think that's huge because a lot of times we wow. think about, well, how do I decide what blade to attach? You don't have to. And today, not only are we taking $10 off, we have three flex pay that expires tonight, so it's I less than $10 you. to get home. But you're getting this precision peeler. I've never seen anything like I, this, John. This I'm looking really at cool. that flex pay thinking to myself, you know, you would spend more than that on this peeler. Now, this peeler, by the way, look at this. It peels in both directions, so it's twice as fast as most peelers, okay? Because mm -hmm. it cuts both ways. Now, I want you to see this. There's a little control ball here. So you don't have to hold it like this when you're peeling. Ah. Now, if you're doing fine things, okay, smaller things, you can use that control ball. So now you're in control. And see how it swivels back yeah. and forth like yeah. this? You can get right around the ends. The end right here, that's for digging the eyes out of your potatoes if you happen to get an eye so you don't have to peel it down and waste everything. Oh. So this little peeler, you would pay more than the flex pay just Absolutely. for this peeler and you're getting that free with your mandolin today. Yeah, it's a set. You're getting it included. <laughs> Here are your choice of colors. I just want to make sure that you get this um, because I do like the fact that you can, you know, you can match it back to your kitchen. Yep. White, green, red, or black. Um, we're so happy that you're shopping for uh, with us this morning. Over 450 have been spoken for. We do have a phone call. We want to oh. uh, invite Carol from New Hampshire in to HSN. Good morning, Carol. You're live on the air with John and Valerie. Good morning. How are you? We're good. Are you picking up your mandolin slicer today? Yes, I am. I'm doing it uh, right now as, as we speak. I just ordered it. Oh, great. What, what was it about about it that made you say, I have to have this today? 
Well, what it was is about, it was the ease of slicing onions yes. and uh, quickly and, okay. and the utility of it. Yeah, you know, everybody hates slicing onions, right? Because they, you, every time you do, you cry. <laughs> Yeah. Right. I it's had a lady terrible. tell me one and time. I love the fact that I can do the potatoes. We love potato and egg, so it's going to be great. Right? Yes. You know, I had a lady An tell me one time. I make eggplant parmesan. This is wonderful. Yeah, I you're going to. I don't think I'll ever use my knife again. <laughs> well, you don't have to. Now you have the tool that does it all. And I'll tell you a little tip, Carol. If uh, um, you don't have to use it for everything that we show you here, okay? If it's just for onions, it's worth it just for the onions. So take it home, you get it when you get it home, put an onion in the machine. You'll see there's like 12 different ways that you can cut onions with it. Yeah, I mean you'll you know, take practice. a bag of onions and just practice, yeah. and you'll have a blast. And but then invite me over because yeah. I'll come. I'll share it all with you. <laughs> But it's gonna make it's it honestly it's gonna make your life so much easier, Carol. And when you think of all the different ways you're gonna use this, yeah. I love that you already have recipes and ideas incorporated into your life already. So thank you so much for uh, shopping with us here at HSN. Oh, that's and fine. I have a question. Yeah. Um, I think I lost her. Yeah. We are our Carol, overhead I'm sorry. speakers Can't hear you. just yeah. went. <laughs> I have a question. There you go. Oh, there yeah, you I would are. like to know, um, how does the blade keep sharpened? Do you have to sharpen it? Oh. No, or you don't. What? And, you know, that's a great question because most people think of it as a knife, right? Well, a knife will hit countertops, cutting boards, plates, dishes. Uh, after you cut through the food, your knife will hit something. And that's what dulls your knife blades, okay? The food doesn't dull it. Your, kni your knife gets dull from hitting the plate or a dish. This blade doesn't touch anything other than vegetables, fruit, meat, and cheese. I found most people get between about five to seven years out of them, wow. okay? And if you do need to sharpen it, you can use a little stick sharpener on the back going all across it, but you probably never have to. It'll stay razor sharp. All right, Carol. Well, you, thank you so much for calling. We're so happy that you're going to enjoy this. Um, John is yes. not going anywhere. You and I are going to hang out for a little longer okay. but this is your uh, this is uh, three flex pay that expires today less than ten dollars to get at home your choice of colors and remember you also are getting the peeler to go along with it so it's a great set taking ten dollars off for you today it's gonna get you